ACI code, number 207.1R05. Guide to Mass Concrete. Mass concrete can be defined as, any volume of concrete, with dimensions large enough to require that measures be taken, to cope with the generation of heat from hydration of the cement, and attendant volume change to minimize cracking. The design of mass concrete structures is generally based on durability, economy, and thermal action, with strength often being a secondary concern. Because the cement water reaction is exothermic by nature, the temperature rise within a large concrete mass, where the heat is not quickly dissipated, can be quite high. Significant tensile stresses and strains may result from the restrained volume change associated with a decline in temperature as heat of hydration is dissipated. The need to control volume change induced primarily by temperature. Change in mass concrete has led to the development of cooling and insulating systems for use in mass concrete construction, as per ACI code 207.4R93. The possibility of cracking from thermal stresses, should be considered both at the surface and within the mass. As per ACI code 207.4R93, cooling systems could be classified as pre-cooling system, and post-cooling system. Pre-cooling system concerns about cooling concrete mix by 1. Lowering aggregate temperature. 2. Use of low heat cement, which is type 2 cement. 3. Use of chilled batch water and ice. 4. Use of fly ash. 5. Use of retarders to minimize required water cement ratio. Post-cooling system. Control of concrete temperatures may be effectively accomplished by circulating a cool liquid, usually water, through thin-walled pipes, embedded in the concrete. Depending on the size of the pipe, volume of fluid circulated, and the temperature of the fluid, the heat removed during the first several days following placement can reduce the peak temperature by a significant amount. Materials of embedded cooling pipes may be aluminium or thin wall steel tubing, 1 inch, 25.4 millimeters, nominal outside diameter, and 0.06 inches, 1.5 mm, wall thickness. Plastic and PVC pipe may also be used. Couplings of the compression type used to join sections of aluminium, or steel tubing should be of the same material, or non-conductor sleeves and gaskets should be provided to avoid the galvanic effect, of dissimilar metals. This drawing shows a cooling system done for mass concrete block, with dimensions of 7 by 7 meters in plan and 2.4 meters in height. As shown, cooling pipes had been laid in three layers. First layer, laid at height of 500 millimeters from bottom of concrete to ensure cooling of bottom layer, which is highly restrained from expansion, by contact with blinding. Next two layers, have been laid at distances of 700 mm in height, keeping top layer at a distance of 500 mm from top of concrete. It is very important here, to pay attention for continuous curing of outside concrete surface, by providing proper shading, and spraying by cold water. Cold water circulation speed, shall be in between 15 to 17 liters per minute, in order to ensure optimum heat exchange between water and concrete. In a chilled water temperature, as low as 37 Fahrenheit, 3 centigrade, has been used for post-cooling. Individual pipe runs, may range from 183 meters to 366 meters in length. With 244 meters being a target value for design purposes. Splices within the pipe runs, should be minimized as much as practical. As per ACI 207. 4 R93, Clause 4.1. After an initial peak concrete temperature has been experienced, cooling is usually continued until the first of these conditions occur. A. The concrete cooling rate reaches the maximum that can be tolerated without cracking, or B. 
The temperature of the concrete decreases to about 17 centigrade below the initial peak value, this is an empirically derived value, generally substantiated by slow strain capacity tests. C. The concrete has been cooled to its final stable temperature, or an intermediate temperature prescribed by the designer. The duration of this initial cooling period, may be as short as several days, or as long as one month. For more detailed information about mixed design, you can refer to ACI code 207. 4R, 93, which will be attached under this video. Thank you for watching. If you found this video useful, please don't forget to give a like, and subscribe to our channel.